Sure, I think our, our care for the course policy is very important. Um, we teach all the juniors to not only fill their divots on the range, um, but also on the course, you know, before play, after play, you know, fill other people's divots that might not have been filled in. Um, and it really just sets a, you know, example for them as they move on to college and, you know, beyond even in the professional ranks, just take care of our facilities. Um, we're very privileged to be out at courses as beautiful as the legend of Merrill Hills. So um, it's really, you know, a, a shared responsibility for the players to, to leave the course in better shape than when they found it. All the juniors will have a sand bottle. Um, and that they'll also have sand out on the course for them to fill their bottles with. And they'll just basically, every time they make a divot, they'll fill it in. And our staff will be watching as they go around. And if we see a junior miss one, you know, we'll give them a couple of warnings. Um, and if it becomes an issue, we actually will issue penalties for that. So um, it's really a, a good system to, to hold the juniors accountable um, and keep the course in pristine condition throughout the week. Um, well, my belief, and, you know, everybody's got a different opinion, um, I think you're managing good behavior is part of the goal with, with caring for the course. If, if the kids are coming to a nice place and the members are setting it aside, the owner is setting it aside, the sponsor is spending the money, you guys are working your tails off, members are coming to volunteer, there's not many things a kid can do to show respect. But to the owners and the people that are passionate about the golf course, you take care of it, right? That's just a sign of respect, and it's a sign of good behavior. Um, and and so, in my mind, the the, the requirement to do it uh, is, is an expectation in my mind, and it should be because it's just a respectful thing. The best thing about this organization is it hasn't fallen in the trap of all the other organizations, and it requires good behavior. So, to me, filling a divot is way more symbolic than it is actual. Uh, I think care for the course is, is really important and I think um, AJGA does a really good job uh, with their, their care for the course. I remember when I played AJGAs um, going out after the rounds and, and doing care for the course. I think it's it's really good because it, it not only shows these junior golfers um, like proper etiquette um, but it also I think shows like the clubs that give up their facilities and their time for, for these guys to be out here at Chisholm that it's not really taken for granted. Um, so I think it's, it's, it's really cool that they do that. I, th I think the superintendents that I've worked with have you know, had a very positive reaction. Um, a lot of associations or t tours, they don't really focus on you know, caring for the course. Um, and the superintendents are always excited you know, when an AJGA event comes in that they know that the course is going to be treated well um, and it's going to be left in better shape than when they found it.